Okay, right now I would like to show how to import raster data into GrassGIS. In my case, I use Grass 8.3. So before we import the data, we should assign a new location. We need to create a new location. Why we can go to here? It say like create new location in current grass database so we click on that it will pop up like this so we can assign new location name so it can be like for example rgb assignment for example and we also can write some description as you want assignment one RGB images and then we can take location here so we can browse to location where you want right now I will choose the location that I want to keep can be inside here is the name select folder and then we click on next we can keep this select Connect reference system from a list by EPSG or description. We keep it check that one and we click next. With the Connect reference system, in my case for Cambodia, we choose 48 and for example. We choose WGS 84 UTM zone 48N. In other country, it would be different connect reference system. So you can change as you want. We select that. And then click next. OK. And finish. And OK again. Right now, I get a new location. Here is the directory that I just set at the moment. Right now, we are ready to import the data, the raster file. To import, first we go to tool on the right hand side here and we choose import export and link data click on the plus sign and then go to import raster data here yeah. and the top one is simplify raster import with reprojection we can double click on that in here at the source type, we choose directory. So the format, we can just keep it there. With extension, we type tiff and directory, we need to browse to where the data is. So in my case, I go to the data, okay, here the data, in my case, I choose the data that I downloaded from Landsat 5 in 2010, so I choose, I select that folder, and then click on select folder, 
and then we select on import so we can see so many tiff file inside the folder when we click import it will be running sooner it will be it will pop up here so now it's importing raster map we can keep it here until the import is finished and here the file that we import still importing raster map so we can wait until it's done okay the import is finished so can close these are the raster that we import into our grass GIS after this we can go to next step so that's all for how to import raster file into GIS thank you